Well hello guys, welcome to episode 17 of the Gone for a Burton Save, I'm the Custard Prophet. So um, we have moved on a little bit as you can clearly see. Um, we've been busy, um, we've got our um, wind turbine, I remembered it this time, uh, growing happily there. Kaufman is settling in, building everything he can do. It's, it's, it's absolutely fantastic. The other thing we've done, we've expanded our, our zone here, um, which which is looking good. And we finally got sterile tiles in there because Ironhead, Mr. Ironhead, sorry, no, Kaufman's are all Egypt's and Moe's. Ironhead is, is busy doing stuff. So we, we, we appear to be doing pretty good. We got a little bit of a gift from the, uh, from the, the, uh, the guys who whoever it was who came, it was the slavers, wasn't it? We we got a gift from them because we were so nice. They gave us some silver, which was good, and they left some permacan also. So it's all going pretty well at the minute. So we will we'll zoom forward and, and see what happens. I, th I thought rather than kind of go too far forward, it might be nice just to <coughs> see the base expand a little bit, the sort of basic episode. Why don't you... No, oh, running away. He's bloody running away. That's because they're going too fast. Can't catch him up. Right, you. Prioritise. Haul, haul that wood. Um, well, I think that is going to help with the situation an awful lot. We can deconstruct that guy. And I'm also probably going to bring in a another one on this side so we can uh, where are we standing lamp yeah we'll, we'll put it in that corner and we'll build a new bed as well and I think that will be nice we, we're still doing well with food it's got one degree it's not gone particularly cold Oh, please, don't get too cold, don't get too cold, you're going to kill my potatoes. Right, that, that's, it's clearly not time, we need, we need to do some harvesting I think. Right. We're going to do it, take it all a bit early, because I'm, I'm a bit worried about that now. That that did look frighteningly close to where we didn't want it to be. I don't know whether we should take this. I guess it's not growing at the minute, minus two. Oh my good God, where was that? Did you see that? Cargo pods galore, what's this? What's in them, what's in them? I haven't had one for ages. Wow, it's bloody potatoes. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm not sure I wanted a load of potatoes, to be fair. Um, I can think of more useful things, but yeah. It is what it is, it's a load of potatoes. Potato, potato, potato. Thankfully, we increase this space. We might kind of go into here and <laughs> I might bring the menace. What I've been thinking about doing is bringing in here a um, and it's sort of like a medicine storage room. So it's right next to them, and then we can have a little door going from it. I think that would be be quite good. Let me know in the comments what you think about. That. I'm never quite sure what the the best thing to do is with all this sort of stuff. We've got a little corridor sort of forming out here, so this actually may all be indoors fairly soon. And um, I mean, I could move this thing because that's kind of a bit of a nothingy spot, isn't it? Let's deconstruct that. There we go. Right now, next up. I want to actually have a proper bed in there. Actually, what we're going to do, I think, uninstall it there and then reinstall it there.
deconstruct that. So I'm basically going to take this bit out, deconstruct that, so we have a prisoner bed now, which I think is quite good. Ooh. Do we get to see this being chased by the nutty soldiers? Oh, we've just destroyed a bed, but you know, if she's willing to share, <laughs> yeah, we'll offer some safety. It's one drifter. I mean, how hardcore can they be? One sand, two sand, three sand, four, five sand, six sand, seven sand more. Where is the nut? Where's the? Let's have a look at one sand. Yeah, she can construct, and she's she's very social. She's awful, awful social. I tell you what, one sand, you can pick up some potatoes on the way. How about that? Where's your mate then? We got five people. Oh. Right, um, where is he then? Hmm, wild boar's dead. Where's he? Right. Matthews. Right. Okay, one son. How's your shooting, my friend? Shooting's good. Well, have I got a gun for you? Equip that revolver, right? Right, Lyra, you have you, my friend. I'm going to go in the. No, you, going to go in there. No, there, Lyra. Leslie, you are going to go. Where's. You're going to go there. Now, slight. Uh, Ironhead, I mean, <laughs> you are going to go there. One Sam's going to get a revolver. Kaufman's utterly useless. You can continue to do. One Sam can go there. You, you can forego your trousers for a second, my friend. Here he comes, big fat lad. He's quite. The David Matthews band. Was oh, he dead? I kill him. No, oh, he's dead. Well, well then, guys. No, yeah. We'll um, we'll dispose of him the only way I know how. Right. Go. You can. I had to stop it. Oh, look at this well-oiled machine. This is. Look at this, my friends. Right, we need... We've got a bit of an issue because we don't have, at the moment, a place for one sand to sleep. 
So at the moment, where are we going? What are we going to do? Because that's that screwed me over a little bit. One sand, two sand, three sand, four. Oh dear! Right, where are we going to put one sand? Um, well, first of all, we're putting putting a light in there and a light in there. Yeah, uh, and then one sun. I don't know. I suppose. Oh, you can't want to. Don't have to go through there. I don't know. There's no real obvious spaces for a room. We could come out in this direction, I suppose, but you know that's not ideal either, because then she's kind of outside. I mean, yeah, I <laughs> just, I don't know what to do. I don't know where to go. Oh no. I just don't know. Where do you put someone like this? We just. We could kind of. Kind of have a room out here. It's a bit, bit weird, but. Or a room in here. I Maybe mean, that's what we do. We kind of. No, I think here is where you go. I think here is where you go. And you just kind of build that out and. What we could do then is just have a, I don't know, yeah, route through here. It's what I was going to put someone else there, but yeah, we'll do this. Take that away. Take that away. And that away. Got a nice stone floor as well. Very nice. Deconstruct that. Right. One sand, two sand. Yeah, I like this. Now, what I'd like you to do, Vokies, is build a door in there. First things first, let's just get a, a bed. A bed in there. And the light. And a shelf. Do, yeah, I suppose in the meantime, I just pop down a sleeping spot there. Set owner has one sand. Not gonna be happy with that, but that's fine. We probably also, because if we're having this as our beautifully big old room, maybe we want to. Have a big old table there. Maybe. So you have two or three people round it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It's it's an interesting one. I was gonna put batteries in here as well, but yeah, one sounds sleeping. Probably not going to be that happy with the whole situation. What's I 
somehow I th okay it is tainted by wearing a co well someone's wearing the corpse's clothes I'm pretty sure of it don't care about it right so well this is all right what I'm thinking of doing actually is building a little battery zone out here or somewhere We've got a little room here we are getting ever closer to these guys though aren't we which is obviously a little bit worrying I mean, do at some point we take this on and go for it. I think there's bloody too many of them now. We could just put a line of guns there, couldn't we? We could, we could. So we've got a colony now of five people, which is looking rather good. So we've really got an opportunity now to go off and explore the world and, and, and maybe go on some of these missions because we've got people at home, we've got guns, all sorts of stuff. Um, and I think when maybe we'll have a little look to that next time. So there was one mission up there that I seem to remember. Yeah, this. So Peace Talks, the Orange Maya Coalition, who we keep bumping into. I wonder whether that's worth going to. I'm not quite sure. I've never done a Peace Talks thing. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see. Um, but once I made a decision, then I will come back. But I hope you've enjoyed that. We're starting to get somewhere, I think, now, which is really, really fantastic. The base is looking fantastic. Um, yeah, drop any comments down below. What should I be doing? What am I screwing up here? How should I be expanding this base? Should I be killing off the insects? Um, should I be putting anything else in the base that I haven't got there already? Should I be moving things around? What do you think about this thing here? All those questions and more. Just let me know down in the comments. If you've enjoyed that, hit that like button. If you want to see more, please subscribe and I'll see you next time. Cheers. Thanks a lot. Bye.